Today, the start of racing was pushed back due to the late finish of the offshore race yesterday. The last of the teams crossed the finish line after midnight, so the race committee decided to give everyone a chance to recuperate before the third day of racing began. Today, the second inshore race was scheduled, but the cloudy skyline and lack of breeze meant that the 150 boats competing were left waiting to start. As the teams waited patiently on the glassy waters of the Marmaris Gulf, the party atmosphere took over. The teams are not just here to race, but also to have a break from their busy schedules and enjoy the warm conditions Marmaris has to offer, even if it is late October. So even when the racing was delayed, spirits were high. Socialising, partying, dancing and swimming made up the morning's activities for this third day as the wind dialed to make an appearance. I'm very happy because I am uh, from the first day till now inside this organization. Uh, we started in 1990 with nine boats and you know uh, last year we have more than 200. Daytime we try to race and nighttime try to enjoy. Everyone smiles so we can smile. Finally a call was made by the race committee and with a storm looming on the horizon, the fleet was sent back to port, but although the day's racing had been cancelled, the partying continued. Once all the crews were ashore, the closing ceremony took place later in the afternoon. The winners from yesterday's race outside the Gulf received their trophies and fun was had among friends old and new. There are still two days remaining of the 25th Marmaris International Race Week and the competition is still wide open for all 10 classes as they make their memories and hopefully take home some trophies. Don't miss it.